name is Lenny Solomon, and I improvise on the violin. Sometimes I play jazz, sometimes I play swing, but the important thing is that I make, I compose on the spot. People ask me what jazz is, and I say, it's composing on the spot. When you wake up in the morning and you go down for breakfast, there is not a script on the table saying, you must say good morning to your mother or father and then ask about the weather. You think of these things and you make a conversation. There's no preset script. And it's the same thing with improvising. So I'd like to show you how to improvise on the violin. I grew up in a classical family, classical music family. My father was a musician, my sister as well. And we enjoyed our classical studies. But it was very important for me to learn how to improvise. Because I realized if you take away the music that you learn, that you read, or you take and you take away things that you've memorized in your mind, my colleagues didn't know what to do with the violin once they had taken away those elements of music. So I became determined to learn how to improvise so that I would always have music with me. That's what I'd like to show you. So we'll start out with some very basic elements in music and improvising. In this course of study, it's expected that you'll have some basic knowledge of the violin, arpeggios and scales, are important and we're going to talk about them. So first of all, let's talk about the lowest, inst lowest note on the violin is the G. If we were to play a G major scale, Those are, that's an eight note scale. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. The notes are G, A, B, C, D, E, F sharp, G. 